Hi everyone, welcome back to Cooking of Love. Today I'm going to share with you one of our favorite recipes for cooking acorn squash. Acorn squash is really easy to prepare and there's so many different ways that you can make it. And today I'm going to show you how we roast acorn squash with butter and apricot jam. This makes a delicious side dish and it cooks in just about 45 minutes. Here's all the ingredients we'll be using and I've listed everything you'll need and the recipe in the description box below. First, wash your squashes thoroughly. I like to do this with hot soapy water and a vegetable scrubber. Acorn squash has a mild, nutty, sweet flavor and it is full of fiber. They're a winter squash and you'll want to choose a squash that is heavy and dark green with a little bit of oranginess on the bottom and make sure it doesn't have any soft spots or blemishes. I think acorn squashes are easier to cut than other winter squash like spaghetti squash or butternut squash and you can cut the stem end off and use that to create a flat surface but because we're going to be filling these halves with butter and jam towards the end of the roasting time, I like to leave the stem end on so that the filling doesn't stream out. Begin by preheating your oven to 450 degrees. Next, to cut an acorn squash, you'll want to use a hefty knife like a chef's knife and cut down between one of the grooves. Angle your knife around the end point and then down the other side. And I'm sliding my knife into the cut and then gently applying pressure back and forth. And this will help split the squash at the stem end where an acorn squash tends to be a bit thicker and harder to cut. Hey, do you have a favorite recipe for winter squash? Drop it in the comments below. Okay, now that your squash is open, use a spoon or a scraper to remove the seeds and the pulp. And you can save these seeds and roast them like pumpkin seeds. I'll be posting some recipes for sweet and savory pumpkin and acorn seeds soon, so I'll post that link in the corner and down below if you want to take a look. And if this is your first time at our channel, welcome! We're making easy, no-fail recipes that you can make with confidence and share with everyone you love. Hit the subscribe button to find out when we've posted a new recipe. Prep a baking sheet or casserole dish with some oil on the bottom and then place the halved acorn squash cut side down. Place the baking sheet into the 450 degree oven and then pour enough water just to cover the bottom of the sheet, about a quarter of an inch of water. And this will keep the squash from burning or getting dried out. Roast the acorn squash for about 30 to 45 minutes, checking to see if you need to add a bit of water to the sheet if it cooks away. Cook the squash until it's tender and you can pierce it with a fork. Then remove the squash from the oven and carefully, these are going to be hot, turn them over. Add about a half tablespoon of butter to each half and then a generous tablespoon of apricot jam. Stick the squash back into the oven for just about five to 10 minutes to melt the butter and begin melting the jam. Then remove the acorn squash from the oven and let it cool slightly before serving. And this is one of my favorite ways to make acorn squash. The apricot jam gives a nice, subtle, tangy sweetness that mixes with the melted butter and this tastes so delicious. It's a nice change up from using maple syrup or brown sugar. Let me know what you think when you make these. And if you like this video, do me a favor and hit that like button to let me know. Thanks again for watching guys, and I'll see you in the next video.